I'm gonna be showing my boot scoop. All right, this is probably one of my my number one takedown. I at least hit it once or twice a match. Um, if I can get it more than times, if I feel like it's there, I'm gonna hit it as many times as I can. All right, a lot of times it catches the guy off guard. Um, it's a pretty pretty slick takedown. So when I, what I'm looking for when I hit my boot scoop, all right, I want to have head position right in his neck here. And he has to have inside control on me here. Alright? Alright, so he has inside control. I have head position on his neck. Right here. I'm gonna push in, I'm gonna feel the guy, alright? You gotta feel his pressure. When he pushes back into you, that's when you know it's go time. Alright? So I push in, right when I feel a little bit of pressure back, I'm gonna my left hand's coming to the mat, my left leg's coming through. Alright? So I push in, he pushes back, right there. Alright? Like a baseball player sliding the second base. Alright? My butt's not on the mat here, alright? A lot of people call it a boot scoop. And they think your butt's on the mat. No. It's not on the mat. Alright? So here, head position. This hand's inside. So it's push on his, This is what pushes, and then he'll push back. So here, you push in. He pushes back. Left hand goes to the mat. Alright? My finish, I'm just finding his legs. Okay. In a match, when you hit it really quick, the guy might fall to the mat, and you can just cover. All right. So here, that's how it looks, real full speed. All right. The guy will just fall to the mat, and you'll cover. So here, head position. All right. Left hand comes to the mat. You're throwing that elbow by, and then you're finishing into him. Head's coming to the outside of his body. All right, my head is coming to the outside over here. Here, this leg comes through, right there. All right, at an angle, and then you pump, uh, explode back into him. Move your take down. It's a real quick move. It's hard to show slow, all right? So here, all right, my foot, is aiming to go right on the outside of his body when I hit that slide. So, right in the outside of his body, and then you turn it. When I was practicing, when I first was learning this, I would do it by myself a lot, all right? I just get there, left hand will come to the mat, I just do that, and then come back, all right? Just to strengthen my shoulder up for it. At first, when you're doing this, your shoulder's weak. It's going to feel really uncomfortable. The more times you hit this, the more comfortable your shoulder gets. Like if I were to hit this to the other side, my right shoulder, it's not, I, I haven't practiced it enough, it's not strong enough. Alright? So my left shoulder is the one I always hit it to. Alright? It has the feel, it can hold my, it holds my weight when I hit it. Okay? So I always hit it where my left hand is posted on the mat. So here, right there, turn in. Covering, finishing double.